Hurricane Ian arrived on September 28th in South Florida and proceeded northeast, just south of the Orlando area. As many know from past experiences, wind and water can do damage in many ways. Our church had water in the sanctuary and preschool and plenty of debris blown around outside. We thank all of the staff and the volunteers who worked quickly to clean up after the storm. Zion Lutheran Church in Fort Myers hosted volunteers in October and November who worked in the area. We had two of our Lutheran early response teams travel to Fort Myers and assist. As you have seen in the media, the damage is extensive. From houses that had foundations washed away, to homes with broken windows and flooding, to boats, cars, and everything else that was tossed around in the storm, the recovery will be long-lasting. Yet, we thank the Lord. He did protect so many from harm and has blessed others with the ability to help through donations and service. He is working through the recovery to allow the good news of his salvation to be shared with families in need. We know that the Lord has shown his mercy and love to many who endured during the storms. And we thank you, the members of St. Luke's, for all the help you gave to our church, your neighbors, the community, the request for assistance from Seminole County, and those all the way to South Florida. We thank you for continuing to pray for and help those who are continuing to rebuild their homes and their lives. The lessons we learn in the storms, just like the disciples in the boat, is that the Lord is still with us, and He alone has the power to calm the storms in our lives. He alone will continue to help us grow closer in faith to Him and to one another. The Lord is our refuge and strength. We will not be afraid.